myself. I'm a bad mother, and I'm smooth as hell. I mean, usually, I'm as cool as can be. You know, I've been thinking about getting the band. Like, we just get away from all the noise, travel the country, you know? Oh, I love that. Yeah, off the grid. I would literally stab someone to be able to do that. Huh? You guys talking about getting a van? Yes, bro. Off the grid life. Uh, the only thing, though, I would... I'm going to be working remotely, so I'm going to need Wi-Fi. Dude, it's, it feels like it's hearing you. Dude, it's, it's definitely hearing you. You're definitely in and out. Like, they know you're... 100%. 100%. For sure. 100%. Yeah. I try not, like, I used to resist them, but mm -hmm. I'm just weak, just like everyone else. And that's when I realized that Cheese and I don't get along, and that I should probably pay attention to what I put in my body. Dude, did you see Tyree drop What? Tyree drop Yeah, I am literally thinking about paying for promoted posts just to get some more reach, you know, but I just kind of want to do it myself. Yeah, yeah, that's awesome. That's awesome. You know, it's hard to find a balance between playing the game and respecting yourself. Yeah. Guilty. Pardon? <clears throat> guilty. I said I'm guilty of that too. Yeah. Mm, yeah. I'm gonna go grab a snack. Uh, do you want some company or? No. <laughs> anyway, did you guys see my Instagram post last week? The one about your dog? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, yeah. I can't believe it did that to your grandma. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> Did you have a nice night? Who's there? You have a nice place. Much nicer than I ever had. Oh, I didn't think I drank that much. You have good taste, too. I like all the plants. You must live alone. This isn't a joke. Who the fuck is there? There's no reason to be afraid. I promise, nobody is here. Who are you? Please just get out. Please calm down. I have a knife and I'm not afraid to use it. Put the knife down. You're going to hurt yourself. What the fuck? Colder. 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 Oh, there I am. Just kidding. Am I... Am I going crazy? That's up to you. <gasps> so... You're dead. Uh, yeah. And you're a ghost. Well, that word is kind of reductive, but sure. And you're here to... Uh, nothing really. Just to hang out. Alright. Cool. My therapist is going to love this. Blah, blah, blah. People are so boring. All they do is talk, talk, talk. Yeah, something I learned. It's harder to listen than to talk. About the same stuff over and over and over. Well, what do you wish people would talk about? I don't know. About how nothing we do matters because we're all gonna die someday. Ha, huh, you don't say. Or about how fucked up we all are. About mental health, about history and war and how people are dying or about science and the future and how computers are killing us maybe you need to be the one to start those conversations nobody is even listening to each other anyway everyone's just waiting for their chance to talk waiting for their chance to show off about their new job or latest vacation and you aren't? <laughs> Give me a break. Are you going to answer those messages? People want to hear from you. You don't even know me. <sighs> oh. 
hello? Good morning. You got more text on your phone. The great thing about being dead is I don't have to sleep anymore. Such a waste of time. You're not in here, are you? No, I wouldn't do that. I don't understand what you are or what you want, but can you please do me a favor and buzz off? Hey, all I know is I'm here to spend time with you. Well, when I get back, don't be. I don't want a roommate, let alone one I can't see. You forgot your phone charger. Miss Independent. Bye bye. You should really give him a call and make an appointment. It'll take just five minutes, maybe even less. That's what Lindsay did, and she saw him, and she's feeling so much better. Uh huh. And if it's a matter of money, just tell me, and we can figure something out. Lindsay has incredible insurance, you know. That new job that she got with the state, they offer terrific insurance. Maybe you should consider working for the state? Yeah, maybe. Okay, sorry, I'm just answering a client text. Nice day. Oh, it's, uh, it's nice out. We're having a nice day. Oh, yeah. Too bad we're stuck in here, huh? who it is. How is work? My mom thinks I should get a new job. She seems to think I'd find more success working for the state. The state, huh? Sounds about as fun as a kick in the shins. <laughs> I don't think she even knows what I went to school for. She just says things but doesn't actually think about what she's saying. She just wants you to be happy and successful, don't you think? No, she just wants me to be successful. Happiness is secondary. Maybe she doesn't know what will make you happy. Have you told her? She didn't suggest I get a new job, so I'll be happier. She suggested it because it has better benefits. What's so bad about having better benefits? I could have used some better health insurance in the end. <laughs> I'm not opposed to good health insurance. I just... I don't want to get stuck in a job I hate in order to get it. Well, do you like the job you have now? Well, I mean, not really, but at least it's in my field, kind of. So what would you want to do if you could do anything? I don't really know. Everyone talks about find a job you love and you'll never work a day in your life. I think that's bullshit, you know? Like, work is work. Even if it's something you love, it's still a job. But it helps to have a job you enjoy. Yeah, that'd be great. But everyone makes it sound like once you find that job, everything will be peachy. I'd rather live in a world where we don't have to have jobs. Just let the robots do everything for you? Kind of, yeah. Like, why not? And we could all do what we want to do instead of having to work. Wouldn't life get boring, though, if nobody had to work? I don't think so. We could all go outside more, watch movies, drink, and dance. And spend more time with friends and family? Yeah, maybe. Uh, 
I like this. Right? I love this song. Did I mention I saw them live? What's the matter with you? What's the matter? What's the matter is nothing matters. <laughs> How can nothing matter if everything is made of matter? <laughs> Don't come at me with logic. Now I'm even madder. <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> I've been thinking about this quote I heard the other day about how to tell if you're an introvert or extrovert. It's about this phrase and how you would feel if someone said it to you. You make me feel alone when I'm with you. Hmm. I feel alone when I'm with you. I don't get it. So you just post photos of where you are and who you're with? Mm, basically. You just share what's going on in your life. You know, I guess if you don't post, it's kind of like you're invisible. Well, maybe I would be good at it then. Pretend I didn't see that. <sighs> that. <laughs> nice one. What do you think? Yeah, I like them. You don't think it's too much? It's not up to me. I like them. But to you? I'm gonna head out for a little bit. All right, I'll just be here, all by my lonesome. <laughs> I won't be out that long. I'll see you later. Yeah, you'll see me later. Jill? <laughs> Where have you been? I haven't seen you in ages. So Hi. Yeah, I've been a little peopled out lately. Oh my god, yes, I feel that. I'm so tired of making small talk over and over. I went to the bars last night and a concert the night before that, and now I don't want to talk to anyone for like a month. <laughs> well, thanks for wanting to talk to me. Of course, it's so good to see you. Yeah, it's good to see you too. Hello? Thank <laughs> you. 
What's up? Not much. Just sitting at home by myself. Wanna get together later? <laughs> <laughs>